this COVID uh, pandemic has affected uh, the whole world and uh, actually taken the whole world hostage and, uh, you know, destroyed lives and livelihoods, uh, affected, uh, you know, our social fabric, um, you know, impacted our politics, economy, and it has shown uh, health is central and it should not be treated as a cost but it should be treated as an investment. So everybody has seen it now, the direct experience, and I hope uh, the world will uh, listen and, and, and act. Uh, and this recommendation, especially the three pathways, are very clear. We're creating a fiscal space and uh, you know, directing investments to health for all, uh, and also governing the public and, and private uh, uh, sector. Health for all is the answer and um, I think we have learned our lessons the hard way and we have to listen to uh, the council that's uh, already proposing uh, the, the pathways to a better world. We need a new narrative. We can no longer see health as a cost but as an investment that's the foundation of productive, resilient, and inclusive economies. Instead of looking at health as a piece of the economy, it's time to look at how the economy can support the societal goal of health for all. This new finance brief shows that neither existing market mechanisms with their focus on short-term returns nor development funds alone are enough. The Council is proposing bold, concrete actions for governments and multilateral organizations in three major areas, creating fiscal space, the direction of investment, and the governance of public and private financing for health. It's time for a new paradigm we have to consider financing for health as a long-term investment, not as a short-term cost.